What's up guys, welcome to another video. So uh, yeah, today I have the Garmin VivoActive 4S. It's the new one, it's like two weeks old and uh, I got it today at a place uh, where I went for a race and um, they sold this. There was a Garmin station and uh, we could see the new products and there it was and uh, I immediately got it because I wanted to get it in October but now it's September 20th and uh, I've got it. And yeah, I'm gonna be doing a, an unboxing and showing you guys the watch. So uh, let's get right into it. Okay, so the box is a bit like a cube. So we can see uh, behind the box, it says uh, seven days of charging, but uh, only five hours of um, GPS and music. So it, it's a lot for uh, a watch. It says you can swim with it, a five ATM water rating. So it's good. And there's music and on-screen workout, Garmin Pay, safety and tracking features. So we can know it's a good watch. Okay. So we're gonna open it. I've never done one of these, so I'm gonna... Uh... Okay, I think it's easy like that, if I'm not mistaken. There you go. Oh wow, the watch is right there, as you can see. Wow, you open it and you can already see the watch. So I'm just gonna get it beside. I mean, it's a great watch. So as you guys can see, there is a charging cable. So you can charge the watch. I don't know where you charge it to. Oh, it's under. I don't know if you guys uh, can notice the thing right there. And uh, yeah, so um, I'm gonna get the box, get things out of the box so we can see uh, there is a, a small little Garmin instruction manual. So yeah, the box empty. I got the watch right here. It's a cool way to present the watch to a buyer like that. It's, uh, I think it's more like professional. I'm gonna get rid of the <laughs> watch that I have now. Just gonna put it right here. And uh, yeah, I love it. So it says to uh, download the Garmin Connect app. So I'm gonna do that with my phone and uh, and yeah, I'm gonna show you guys uh, the process of connecting your watch to your smartphone. So I hope it's gonna be as easy as it was with the Apple Watch. So let's go. First, go on the App Store and look for the Garmin Connect app. Once the download is complete, open it and create an account or if you already have one, just connect on it. To create an account, you will need an email and a password. Once you're done creating your account, the app will load a screen where you will have to enter the watch that you own. In our case, it's the Vivo Active 4S. If you haven't already removed the screen, please do it now because we will have to access the screen of the watch. Once you're done removing the plastic, you will have to sync your watch to your phone. Uh, myself, I had a, a problem. It didn't sync the first time, but then uh, when I retried, it did automatically. So uh, you may have a problem, don't stress. And uh, after that, you will have to enter a number that will be shown uh, on the watch into your phone. Once you're done entering the number on your phone, you will need to give access to your phone a few things like your location and your calendar. Once you've done that, you have successfully entered all the information needed to connect to your watch. You will have to uh, create your profile. You can enter a photo of yours. After that, the Apple Health app should appear and you can select every option. It doesn't really matter. You're just gonna have uh, every data on your phone. So I guess that's a plus. Then you have the privacy settings. You can share uh, your profile with your friends, your contacts or everybody. Then you will have to answer a few questions that will let Garmin know a bit about you. And uh, it will uh, let them calculate your body fat percentage and also the amount of calorie you burn for certain exercise. 
after that you will have to enter when you go to sleep and when you wake up I think it's gonna customize a, a setting that will allow you to uh, put uh, do not disturb on your watch so you don't receive notifications when you sleep so that's great after that enter which hand you will have the watch on after that Click yes to always give your watch some new data. It will uh, keep track of your exercises and everything. Then you will have the option of setting new daily stats, like the amount of steps you do in a day, or the amount of stairs climb, or even the amount of intensity minutes per week. You will have to sync your watch and your phone together it could fail on the first time so just press retry and uh, as you can see you will uh, get it on the second try there's no problem there so i'm scrolling for the first time right now to see uh, any option i'm not gonna go in any details because uh, i'm gonna do a separate video on uh, everything you need to know uh, on the garmin vivo active 4s but uh, yeah Stay subscribed and uh, you will have another video uh, soon uh, in a week or so. So right now uh, I'm going to be opening uh, the charging cable. Um, it's a very, very small one. I uh, honestly uh, was surprised on how small it was. Uh, it's not that practical, but I mean, it does the job. It's a charging cable. It's not like you're wearing it uh, every day. So the cube does not come with the watch, obviously. And then I struggle a bit to plug the cable in the watch at first. But then I, I figure it out. And uh, it is still hard to put it uh, in the hole of the watch. But I guess you will get use of it. So uh, soon it will be uh, as easy as it is uh, with any other charger. And as you guys can see, it is charging. Uh, my camera was a bit blurry during this video, but uh, I guess it did the job. Alright guys, so uh, that's been it. I've done the unboxing. Now I'm going to do another video where I'm going to show how uh, it works and all the features and everything. So uh, you guys can subscribe and look on the channel uh, in the next few days or weeks. Um, most likely in a range of a week. And uh, yeah, I have a positive review on it right now. And hope it stays like that with me uh, having it one week on my wrist. So um, that's been it. See you guys in the next video. Peace.